And welcome back to the Until Dawn Let's Play. We're here with Mike, Fingerless Mike, Eight Finger Mike, uh, who has just chopped his fingers off. I didn't even bother opening the bear trap because we want to keep the machetes. So let's go wander around. I still don't know how to get to the electric chair. Oh no, that shows up later. Never mind. I'll shut up. Let's look at the head in the jar. So they killed a Wendigo and they put its head in a jar. What was that? I, no, we don't want to hear anything else making weird noises. Are you serious? Now I gotta find a fucking key. You had to find it before. That makes no sense. Oh, I hate creepy noises like this because now I don't remember what was causing it. Oh, now I remember what was causing it. Except I don't really remember, but that's okay. We'll go through all the paces anyway. Pulling open all the trays, see what isn't there. Something around the neck. Attacked by inmate. Good. Fatal laceration to the face. I mean, neck. How are these still on? Seriously. Jump scare? Jump scare? No, jump scare. I'm disappointed. Alright, what do we got here? Registration of death, Sarah Smith. Uh, six to eight, eaten by attacker. Goody. So, cannibalism. Cannibalism everywhere. I think this is the one where there's a jump scare. Let's see. That's disturbing. How did the rat get in there? I like how he doesn't even like react to it. Oh, that's right. There's the key card thingy. That is a complicated okay, card. Who would? Why would they leave that in there? It makes no sense. I also like the air shaders up on the ceiling. That that works. All right, back to the door. Go ahead and drop your card in. I love that this is a quick time event. Put the card in the slot. Grab the card, and here we go. And then we walk into the chapel. Anything? No? Nothing exciting? Okay. Trucking on. Upstairs. Just calmly wandering up the stairs. It's no big deal. Like how he's coddling his heart. Oh god! Son of a bitch! Alright, that got me. Run, boy, run! Okay, then. Why is this guy just wandering around all the time? How does he not see you? Seriously. Is this a quaint little psycho crab? Yay, quaint little psycho crib. Never mind the wolf that just tried to kill you. Anything over here? Uh, stairs, stairs. Oh yay, now I get to jump back down. That was a hell of a jump. What, like 20 feet? 16 feet? The guy is invincible. How does he not ever get hurt? See, it totally sounds like Lost. Alright, let's open this stupid door. <laughs> 
So deliberate. I'm going to open the door. Yaw. Oh, God. Oh, punch the dog. No. Damn it. Son of a bitch. How did I not punch the dog? Alright. So I didn't punch the dog, and I didn't do something else stupid. This pisses me off. They made that hard on purpose. I'll just keep trucking on. So, what have we here? Yeah, grab your jacket. Just because I don't know where the episodes are to go back, and like I don't want to have to redo all of something, so we'll just wander through it as it is. We'll get a chance to screw the dog later, I'm sure. Come on. There you go. Subtle. Nice. He never checks to see if it's loaded. Never looks around for ammo. Just takes it and assumes. Fucking freak. Uh, not really. He's the only one that knows what's going on, but you don't know that yet. Let's see if I can actually get out of the room. Hey, I made it. All right, let's see what we got. Hey, look, a chest. Oh, yeah, that's right, the bones. Maybe this will keep the wolves fat and happy. Yeah, that's disgusting. But just put it in your pocket anyway, it's all good. Is this a clue? No, there's no clue here. All right. What else you got? We're wandering. We're wandering. I like all the cages everywhere. This place is great. I would feel safe here. This big open chapel with all these cages on the sides where I could keep all of my friends. And they would never touch me or talk to me. It would be great. I'd be psychotic. Stogie stash exposed. Yeah, there's one in there. That's that's a hell of a stash. And who would leave that open? It completely defeats the point of a humidor. You must keep them moist. You want to keep them moist. I think you want to keep them moist? Or dry? I don't remember. You put them in a humidor. That much I know. Ah, uh, shooting the lock. So stupid. Ow. That was loud. Alright, let's see what we got. Nothing exciting over here. Let's go through the doorway. Uh, this leads to the outside. Alright, let's see if there's anything else out here. I don't think so. I think it's a dead end. Hey, shocking. Alright, never mind. Wander back out here. Can I go around? The answer is yes. Anything exciting in the walls? No? Okay. Let's keep going. Hey, shiny. Okay. Oh, that's right. What? No. I guess I saw enough of it then. And I'm pretty sure we got that last time, so don't worry about that. And I'm pretty sure we got this last time, too, but we'll get it anyway. So you can find totems inside. That makes sense. Huh. Interesting. So a lighter and a spark. I know at the end... On our playthrough last time, we just he broke the bulb, and then Sam turned on the switch and fried him. I wonder if it's going to be different now somehow. We shall see. Walking down the stairs. I still don't understand why you would have that big staircase to get down to this, like, basement. You know, it just, the aesthetic design choice just doesn't do it for me. 
And you can say, oh, it's a sanitarium. It's not for you. I don't care. Why is there a set of stairs down to this little sub-basement place? I see there's an elevator over there. Is that meaningful? Who knows? All right. Let's see what was here. Oh, yay. Of course. Locked. That's okay. You have a gun. Just shoot it. What am I doing? Oh, I'm angrily moving things. Okay. That makes sense. Dude, at least look at what you're shooting at. Ow. Oh, yay. Fire. Oh, that's good. Nice, we're done. Ah, back to Sam in the shower scene. Heh. <laughs> Lock with the click of a mouse. The upper cable car station. Let's hit the button. And hey, it's locked. But we can't climb How over it. That? And there's some seriously uncool shit. Such a tall there. fence. How will we ever get past it? Let's just walk through the woods. I can't believe Josh is dead. I can't believe how he died. No, I, I mean, what if they were wrong? What? Maybe we should have checked the shed to see if it was really Yeah, good. maybe you should have. There are some things that once you see them, you can never unsee them. Like you. Yeah, I guess, but... Some things you have to see for yourself. I'll take the word for you it. You are a wimp, sir. Actually, let's go see. Come on, show your choices. Wow, his charity sucks. That's great. We've managed to change the world Look. by making him cynical. I feel better with an axe. Why would you get an ah? Stupid. Hit the right button. All right. So there's the missing axe. So the question is, why was it embedded in the side of the cable car station? Oh, what now? This is locked, Matt. We'll break the door down, will ya? Whoa, wait a second. If we start smashing shit down, he's gonna hear he us. He who? Well, you got any better suggestions? I don't know. What about... Look! What? The window. That's great, Matt. I can just about fit my lip balm through that little slot. Oh, Man, I hate her. You will never fit through there, big guy. I bet you everybody hates her. You know what? Screw it. I'm gonna be angry and smash the door. Okay, fine. Here it goes. I'm gonna huff, and I'm gonna... What's with the humor? Makes no just sense. Do just do it. I hate a grain with her. Oh, wait. It's uh, waiting on me. I remember now. You kind of are bad at this. Ha, <laughs> you got it stuck. Let's try it again. There we go. Entering the spooky cable car station that was basically already up. Oh, wait. Hey, at least there's lights. That's encouraging. Gotta be the guy, though, the one who who got to Chris and Ash and Josh. He's gotta know this is the only way back. And he effed it up for you. Look, the cable car's all the way out there. Well, that's I, I mean that's not far, right? You, you can jump. Pitch, does it look like I can jump that? Good, him, but not that good. Flattered, though. Well, <laughs> Matt, if you can't jump that, what are we gonna do? I don't know. Maybe try to turn it on. Ugh. Everything is like so busted up. All your complaints. I think they knew exactly what they were doing. You can't do anything useful. What is in here and why can't I look at it? Very friendly. <sighs> Unfollow. Oh, uh, how funny. Alright, get out of the way, son of a bitch. Alright, there we go. Someone really did a number on this joint. Such a mess. This place was barely in working hey, condition before, Fire and now. Tower. Hey, Magellan, maybe we should get the cable car working. Hey, look, a fire tower. That's exciting. 
Notice operators. That's what that said there. All right. Let's check out the controls. What am I? What am I doing here? All I have is a back. Oh, there's a key. That's right. There we go. No keys. No cable car. So back to square one. <gasps> what about the fire tower? Oh, now you like the fire tower that? idea. That makes well, most sense. I guess it's an option. Oh, maybe it has a radio or something. I mean, it, it would, wouldn't it? I guess. What else is a fire tower for? Yeah. Matt, we gotta get to that radio. Okay. Let's disagree, because I don't like you. I don't know, ma'am. That, that could work, but I, I kind of think that maybe we... We'll get you waffling. Get it's so cute. Everyone, everyone's been split up for so long. Wait. For real, what is it with you and going back to the lodge? Why wouldn't you go back you to the lodge? Just hide out in your room and cry. What? No. Don't be a pussy. We gotta do this. God, I hate her. Fine. I am kind of glad that she died in the playthrough. Not gonna lie. Maybe there's a way to get her to die early. I mean, no, there's the whole fire tower thing. So let's see what we can do there. So why are we going this way? This is what I don't understand. Oh, hold up. Why don't you just go out the other way? What's cooking? Good looking? Getting us out of here, Mr. Meat for Brains. Oh my goodness. Your dynamic is stupid. Seriously, why would you go this way? Why don't you just go out and around? Oh. Follow her. Go back out to the door and then go around. What are we doing here? Oh, look at this bad boy. You're coming with me. Where did that light come from? Why are there uh Just stupid like movie magic? magic. Totally get out here this way. Oh yeah, this seems totally safe. Oops. Oh, damn it. I should have let her fall. You are right. Yeah. I am just hosing this up entirely. Thanks. Maybe um you should go first to protect me. I got to remember not to do the certain quick time events. Okay. But it's so hard. I mean, you just you train yourself to do them. How can you not do them after that? Oh my gosh. Almost. Uh, Almost. I'm feeling kind of faint. Don't look down. Look down. Just just fall. Whoa. Nobody cares. Okay. Holy thank God that's over. Yeah, for real. I should have just let you fall. I actually don't know if that would have worked. I won't know just yet. I'm going to have to redo it. Maybe we'll put in an episode where I go back through uh, a couple of the choices. I mean, that'll change the whole thing, though. But what if it doesn't work? Oh, what if it doesn't work? You're going to whine about it. How surprising. If it doesn't, we need a plan. No, you don't. Maybe... We can just climb down. Yeah, just climb, climb down. down. That's what? good. The mountain. Are you serious? Yeah, sure. Why not? What's the big deal? It's, it's not like it's floating in the sky. But <laughs> it might as well be. It's pitch black out. It's not. Hey, There's plenty of moonlight there. Shut to. up. You think the psychopath is just going to give up and run away? Yep. No. But maybe we should find a safe spot. A safe spot. A like lodge. the lodge. It, it'll be like See, why don't you just follow your own recommendation? Ah, oh, you don't know that. You don't know anything. Shut up. Nobody likes you. I hope I'm not walking past anything. I haven't seen anything glinting. That doesn't mean it's not there. Come on. Go up the stairs. I'm going to try the power walk. I don't think it'll get very far. Why are there so many twists and turns in this place? I mean, how would you possibly ski through here? Up. 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 Come on. Ugh. What's with all the cow noises? Dang it, pick up the stupid thing. There we go. Thank you. Okay, so those two probably live. All right, there's a moment of truth coming up and I have to remember not to screw it up. Because we're walking out toward the cliff. All right, we'll get through this before we end this episode. Just to see how we do. 
Dan Cliff. Yes, Matt. Given the choice, I prefer not to spend my evening plummeting to my death off a snowy cliff top. You think? Up. Oh. oh my god, what is going on? Oh my god, what is going on? This is... I'm not gonna lie, that's just weird. It's definitely weird. Okay, I have to get this quick time event. Damn it. Alright, well I guess we'll call it there. Once again, be sure to like and subscribe. We'll come back to Sam in the Bath next time. Thank you for watching. Bye bye